What's up, y'all? Welcome today to my channel. My name is King Inc. Today I'm gonna be trying Ed Sheeran's hot sauce, Tingly Ted's. Tingly hot sauce mixed by Ed and Ted. And I believe it's gonna be like a jalapeno sauce. But the reason I even have this is because I went to Dollar Tree and I was shopping and I saw this. So I'm gonna get straight into this. I won't drag it on too long. Make sure to subscribe. I have seen some Vienna sausages, rice, and eggs that I'm gonna try this on. I recorded this recipe just now, but I added some Kewpie mayo. It's got a nice egg on top. We got fried up Spam and some rice from yesterday. I'm gonna go ahead and pour some of this on this. Gonna do the smell test first. Again, I really love the design already. And so far, so good. Doesn't taste, doesn't smell like it's gonna be a bad experience, but it's definitely adjacent to maybe let's see it's one of the it smells like taco bell hot sauce but i think it might be oh my gosh i think it's the uh the hot taco bell hot sauce it might be i don't remember but that's what it kind of smells like so it smells very like oh my god what is that it smells a lot like carrots i'm not gonna lie i don't know why it smells like carrots like it smells very like vegetable but we're gonna go ahead and try this because otherwise it's sour. You got a little bit of that pepperiness, but I don't necessarily smell classic jalapeno. Has a really nice little lid right there. Obviously it comes with a seal for freshness. So I know some people get a little bit worried when it comes to Dollar Tree food, but I think sometimes new Dollar Tree stuff just because Sometimes new stuff comes out to Dollar Tree just because sometimes it's a good access to getting into the food market sometimes. So we're going to try. We've got some Spam. I mean, not Spam. Vienna sausages, rice, Tingly Ted's. We're going to try it. Already, already, I'm trying Tingly Ted's on some rice and sausage. I ended up putting it on my whole plate. Because for the taste, it's very sour, has a lot of vinegar, but it definitely has a very refreshing taste. It's not too heavy. It's not too spicy either, but it does have that spice where it kind of like hits the back of your throat, but it tastes very, very good. So if you're having a food, I'd say that's like kind of fatty. This works. This works because definitely the uh, acidity and the spice is going to cut through heavy food. So like right now with my eggs, Vienna sausages and rice and the kewpie mayo it's all very very kind of like not like a thicker texture but it's just like a deeper richer taste so it definitely helps definitely helps with foods like that where you want to get an aftertaste out or just definitely masks sometimes the boring parts of other food i just feel like it definitely fills in the gap so so i'm not gonna lie ed you kind of ate with this one I'm not gonna lie. Literally the last thing that I thought that I was gonna get from Dollar Tree just for groceries was fucking random ass celebrity hot sauce. Nothing would have let me know that this was Ed Sheeran's or validly maybe I just haven't been keeping up with like albums and arts and just like what he's been up to right now. I do really love the packaging. That's my favorite part. That's the reason I even picked it up. That's the reason that I even picked it up, just because I like the orange, the combo with the green is really nice, and there's a whole little bear just on it, so I I grabbed it, okay? But I will say it still definitely has the quality of, like, hot sauce packets from restaurants. So for the Dollar Tree price, this was $1.25 at Dollar Tree. It's, it's not bad. This is worth it, and it's good. I say pick this up. If you're at Dollar Tree, pick up Tingly Ted's. But if this were to be like $6 or something, I'd be mad. Not So this has potential, but they have to up the quality if they're going to be serving this up at other places that are not Dollar Tree because this is definitely just like a $2 below hot sauce. And for it being $1.25, that's perfect. This is great, great option to expand your hot sauce collection without, you know, your wallet exploding. So... If you haven't already, you guys, make sure to hit the subscribe button. Thank you so much for watching my little review today. It was just kind of a follow-up of what I had been cooking um, from before because I made another recipe video. I almost freaked out because I had forgot to schedule a video, but thankfully the video that went out um, two days ago, I think as of me posting this one, 
thankfully that went out right on time literally i had like three minutes to spare on the upload and i exactly don't have internet so i'm so scared but again thank you guys if you haven't already check out all my social media down below uh check out my website i'd be writing some new stuff i'm working on a new little book and i also have my monthly habit tracker listed there on my etsy shop that you can go ahead and buy because it definitely helps me out with remembering just everything that i need to do for the month and it's not that crazy i just like filling in bubbles and to-do list vibes like i always like the little fill in the bubble and it feels like you're taking a test and you know all the fucking answers. So then you're like, mm. that's why I made my to-do list bubbles. Okay, so go check it out. Let me know. Let me know what you think. Because I want to give you guys stuff to add to your inventory just for things to be just easier. Easier to manage. Because I stress and I overthink. And my brain feels like that episode of Spongebob where it's on fire and he's getting fired or whatever. But thank you guys. I hope you guys have a great one. And here's till next time. Bye.